morning. Welcome to 4 by 8 Paper Stuff. This is The Art of Noticing by Ebenezer Scrooge and Tiny Tim in one journal. Um, I've had some more camera difficulties. So these clips are all of me talking, but I could not upload the voice part. Uh, I'm, I'm fighting with camera equipment. These are photocopies of some Mark Bradford. No, Mark Rathko. Mark Rathko from the 40s prints. I kind of cannibalize them and procreate and put bits and pieces together. This is another one I got off of Pinterest, and I'm not sure who this one is. Um, it's a collage piece. And I uh, am going to use these in my journal today. Now, this is um, Mark Rathko, and I'm taking bits and pieces of it. And putting it in both journals. In doing this, I am hoping to create two different backgrounds for two different spreads and playing with these pieces of paper. Again, with the concept of making something semi ugly into something semi pretty. Um, I don't really dislike these at all. Again, camera issues. I'm having to fast forward all of these. I am using techniques from Mark Rathko and Mark Bradford both again. This is a technique that Mark Bradford has done with tiny strips. I'm making it my own by adding tiny strips. Is this something other people don't do all the time? Correct. This is not a new concept. Obviously it's just strips of paper on top of other strips of paper. But I used up some scraps and made a collage of junk and now I'm cutting it into strips and putting it on top of a piece of art and creating something else for Tiny Tim and Ebenezer Scrooge. <laughs> uh, and I'm going to read you the sidelines, the stories of the art of noticing for both of them. Um, first we're going to go with Tiny Tim and his is... He's the positive side of life, and this one that I'm doing right here, and it's my favorite time of day is seeing Dad's face when he sees me waiting for him after work so we can walk home together. We always have the best conversations then, having one-on-one -on -one time with Dad, just being able to talk to him alone. We can talk about anything. Thanks, Dad. And I'm reiterate this. I'm taking opposites of grumpy Ebenezer Scrooge, positive and happy Tiny Tim, with ugly pieces of paper, making them pretty, um, in my opinion, and all in all, the art of noticing the concept from Allie Edwards, and uh, this I'm adding a lot of yellow to. Um, and Contrasting a lot of things, um, positive and negative, color and not color, um, 40s art compared to today's art, um, all of this in the art of noticing. I'm noticing lots of different things happening from opposite ends of all kinds of spectrums. And I like doing this a lot, therefore that's why I do it all the time. <laughs> um, but it's just a way for me to stay in Tiny Tim and Ebenezer Scrooge, The Christmas Carol Life, until we go home and hopefully my Allie Edwards journals are there. Okay, so now this is the Ebenezer Scrooge side. And I do it a little bit differently. And that one, the journaling, is what makes Tiny Tim want to hobble to the office, wait in the snow for Cratchit to get off work just to walk home together. Why can't the boy wait for his dad to get home from work? Um, and this one, I added a little bit more yellow, a little bit more red, some Chinese characters, language characters. Does it matter that I'm in China, a different continent than England, uh, a different era than the Victorian era? Nope. I think they can all go together. Um, and I like this one a little bit better. Um even though I'm contrasting the browns and the pinks and the yellows with this red, 
and I'm adding that splotchy um, stamp that also came from that mood tape order that I got. Um, and again, it's just comparing and noticing. With a theme, so that I have a focus, no different than using a prompt. Um, and keeping myself with a project to finish out November and get ready to go into December. I cannot believe we're at the end of 2020, but hopefully we are at the end of 2020 and we can put it behind us. I've been saying that for the last three years, two years, 2018, 2019, and 2020. I want to write them all off um, for many reasons. Um, hopefully 2021 can create something different. So I hope you uh, understand my thought process. I don't have to have you understand. Um, as long as I'm having fun and you're having fun watching them, that's all that counts. And I'm having fun and I hope you're having fun. So thanks for watching. Tomorrow is probably going to be the last one, I think. And we're ending it with what both people say all the time. Tiny Tim and Ebenezer Scrooge. But I thought that was an appropriate way to end it. So, thanks for watching. Um, and I will see you all tomorrow here. I'm kind of thinking I might have figured out what's taking these video clips and messing with them speed-wise. Um, also, cross your fingers. My little brain technology-wise is a challenge at times. So, thanks for watching again. And I will see you all um, tomorrow.